hello dear friends how are you all so if you want to make a neon light effects uh, uh, just uh, like this this uh, PSD file you can follow my step you can follow my foot step you can see before and after so after this effect how did I create it created it you can follow me just simply click a new file your PG will be 1920 and 180 please create and download this image from our description and place this image into place this image on your photo on your uh, background after placing is done when your placing is done you need to go to your adjustment layer please go adjustment layer and hit the black and white button and then again uh, go to your exposure your exposure will be minus 43 or 45 something like that I think 43 is good and then again you need to go your adjustment layer click adjustment layer click adjustment layer and click curves your uh, image need to be a little bit darker because we want a dark effect in our uh, neon text so that's why we need to uh, use this curves tool for this for this dark effect then another uh, uh, work is need to be done if this is gradient simply select this foreground to transparent hit ok and then double click here and then make this color black double click here and again double click here make this color black and then hit the ok button and your uh, scale will be radial your angle will be 45 to, um, 35 to 45 uh, 35 to 45 42 is okay i think and your scale will be 120 or 130 123 and your mood will be reverse so this is awesome i think 34 or 35 is okay then simply hit the ok button after when you are done with this gradient your opposite mood will be 50 to 70 according to our images uh, mood you can set the opposite dear friends so, so please uh, write our text create a new layer that will be text layer uh, select uh, text tool and your font will be uh, uh, please download this font from description i will give you the link uh, tutorial uh, anything any word you can uh, write here there will be no problem simply double double click on this tutorial and create a drop shadow uh, your drop shadow will be a uh, mood will be screen blend mode will be screen color will be white and opacity will be 100 i think okay and it's spread 10 size 10 this is okay you can follow the angle what angle will be 90 i don't think distance i need here no, we don't we don't need distance here distance will be zero spread will be 12 or 10 and the size will be 10 also and then select outer glow your blend mode will be screen mm, your opacity you can see here what i am giving there your color will be something like a green color mm, you can choose uh, choose any color you want but uh, we need to select a suitable color for this text just uh, uh, simply follow my text code color code i think uh, this color code is okay you can you can uh, just uh, simply place this color code in your uh, color picker and uh, spread uh, then size 40 
to yes uh, this is okay i think uh, range will be 50 and you need to create a new dark uh, shadow and just uh, simply hit the plus button then uh, there will be new dark shadow color will be black blend mode will be screen opacity is uh, as usual and your distance uh, i think 20 to 30 distance and spread will be blend mode will be normal yes blend mode will be normal otherwise uh, this uh, shadow effect will not show up here and the size uh, 24 to 27 this is okay i think then hit the ok button you can see this then we need to create new shape layer shape layer uh, under the text layer just simply select the my uh, select this tool and uh, choose a color in your foreground your color will be 00b357 i think this is the color we choose for for the text then ctrl d for deselect and filter blur gaussian blur your radius will be 180 or 190 okay your opposite will be uh, 50 to 60 and your blend mode will be multiply okay friends so this is this was our task to do and if you have anything any question please uh, comment here please like comment share please share with your friends thank you very much thank you very much please subscribe